is. Now, this is a subject that's very close to me because I've had huge fears of failure that I've been able to overcome. And I've been a huge procrastinator. And I would procrastinate and procrastinate because I didn't want to start doing something and realize, oh, yeah, here's another thing that I can't do. Here's another example of why I'm such an idiot or so dumb or whatever. And uh, now, not to say I'm not a procrastinator anymore. I am, and it's just simply because it's become a pattern of mine. And so now, when I realize that eh, I'm procrastinating, I have to be like, okay, let's just get it done, get it done. And uh, because I've been getting so much practice and getting it done, I've been experiencing a lot of successes in my life. Like, for example, um, a, a while back, I had pitched a show to Rogers Television um, a youth talk show called Rant that I wanted to host and produce for them. And I'm like, I had this idea, I wrote the proposal, I pitched it, they loved it, we did it. We had four successful years, over 100 shows in the can, and it was awesome. So I apply that, and other things that I do now too, is that if it's something that I just want to do, I, any fear that I have towards it, I first have to look at it and see how realistic these fears are. Is it something that something gnawing at me because it just doesn't feel right? There's, you know, maybe it's not something I should pursue right now, or is it simply a fear that is just keeping me where I am, preventing me from experiencing success in my life? And so many times that's what it is. And if you allow those fears to prevent you from experiencing life, you are not going to be the best that you can be. You're not going to live a life where you're utilizing all of your gifts and you're experiencing joy in your life. So many times that fear just keeps us planted right where we are. And if you're not totally happy with your life, if there are areas in your life, whether it's relationship or it's career or it's friends or it's your health, it's your weight, if there are areas in your life where you're unhappy with, what fear is preventing you from overcoming that crap and being able to get to a place where, where you're loving your life, where you're experiencing joy? So, and it's only you. Like, it's you that's preventing you from being happy. So it's only you that could face that fear and just simply plow plow through it just get it done just go for it stop it just stop doing what you're doing because if what you're doing is not working then it's time to move forward and if you feel like you just don't have the strength you don't have the courage to move forward get assistance get a resource to help you to do it that's why so many coaches are popping up all over the place because coaches can help you walk you through those doors, those doors that seem so freaking scary. So instead of just staying where you are and allowing that fear to just put you in a place of, oh, the word I was going to say was incapacitation. Is that the right word? Anyways, there you go. (laughs) Use it for whatever it's going to work for you. So get some assistance. Now, I am a coach. Maybe working with me would work fantastic for you, or maybe there's someone else out there that would be a perfect match. So find someone. Maybe it's your spouse. Maybe it's a friend. Find someone who can guide you, who can be that support to help you get you out of your crap and get you into a successful place, help you get to a place that's going to keep opening doors. There's so many opportunities out there for you, and you are so worthy of those opportunities. So now it's just the time to do something about it. So after listening to this, what are you going to do? Take the first step on starting to make those amazing amazing changes in your life. If you want to email me, if you have a question that you want me to follow up and do another video blog on, throw it at me and I can help you with it. You can email me, you can call me, and I can help you walk through those fearful doors. Okay, so all the best. Kick some ass.